Good morning. I'm going to present the principal characteristic of the Basin Web project. This project is focused on skill development through participatory assessment and simulation using web tools. The Devising Web project is financed by Alpha 3 program from the European Union and developed in collaboration between two European universities and four Latin American universities. The Devising Web project addressed some of the main problems of Latin American universities. The first one is dropout of studies or student desertions during the first or second year, especially by students from more disadvantaged social classes. And the second one is the postgraduate insertion into the labor market. Our conceptual framework is based in e-learning oriented assessment. Um, as Thomas said, assessment mod models which are used in university tends to reproduce the norms and habits of one social group, in particular limiting the possibilities for students of other social origins. The project in action, active learning, through students' participation in assessment process through strategies such as self, peer, or co-assessment. These strategies promote autonomous learning, empowerment, and self-regulation through critical reflection of their own performance. As you can see, can see in the picture, this project offers an alternative approach to college learning assessment based on the use and incorporation of innovative technologies. There are two different target groups in, in the project. Uh, from an institutional perspective, are the universities participants in the project and organization and collaborating entities of the project. And from the perspective of the participants, uh, there are students teacher of the participant universities, senior academics who train university teachers, and staff um, responsible for academic uh, guidance and advice to college students. What are we aiming to, to achieve? We want to reduce the dropout rate, increasing the rate of employment, raise the level of employability, increase the skill levels of, of our students, promote the improvement of computer tools and web-based assessment, encourage innovation in universities, encourage professional development of university teachers, and strengthen collaboration between universities and, and companies. We can distinguish between different final products in the project. The first one uh, is a catalog of work related and professional skills. To write this catalog, a, a study was developed in order to analyze the importance given to different soft skills by stakeholders, the companies, teachers, and the students. The results showed a need to promote five competences. Teamwork, communication, ethics, analysis and critical thinking, and decision making. Uh, we have designed three online training programs for the development of skills. Um, this one is a BAPES program, an online training program for the development of e-learning oriented e-assessment in university teaching staff, a preval program, an online program for the development of evaluation skills in first year university students, and a DECOM program, an online training program which is aimed at final year university students. These training programs focus on the importance of assessment in the teaching and learning process. These programs are going to be implemented in, in each of the Latin American universities involved in the, in the project. 
we have improved two resources with this project. The first one is Eval Comics Web Service. This web service helps teachers to design assessment tools and it's used by the students. And the other one is the Eval Web Service. This is a software that enhances the design of assessment procedure and widens the technical pedag pedagogical options. Furthermore, we have designed another tool called Dino. It's a tool for innovation in assessment. And perhaps the most important innovation in this project is the creation of two serious games, A Day with Eva and University Welfare. These games allow students to practice their assessment skills through daily situations, and they combine entertainment and, and learning. Finally, another major product is the creation of Euro Latin American Institute for the Development of Evaluation of Learning. It will be a forum for the management of knowledge concerning the advance and challenge for the diffusion of good practice in evaluation in higher education. Well, uh, that's all. You can access to all this information from the website of the project. Thank you very much.